Constant optimization of small little things in your life is a good way to free up time so you can do other things. I'll give you a couple of examples. Before this tomato plant was growing here, uh, we needed to buy some tomatoes. But now we rarely buy tomatoes because we we actually have all the tomatoes we need from, from this single tomato plant. Growing your own food is one way to optimize things. Before I installed this water filter with water from the temple, I needed to buy water either from a store or from an RO machine, reverse osmosis machine. I didn't cover up bananas before and I needed to throw a lot of them into the compost and I didn't have as many bananas to eat as I have now. Before this wood was not treated with anything but after treating it with one million different things now there's not so much dust around. There's much more time to do other things than cleaning up after all the dust. There's a stone floor here now so it's a lot easier to keep clean and nice compared to the dust before when there was dirt here. And it's easy to find other different things. You can just try to either write down all the things you do every day. And you should focus on the things that you do either frequently or take up a lot of your time sometimes. Or maybe just makes you think a lot about stuff. It's an endless journey and I think it's good to just use a little bit of time a little bit of your total time to optimize these things because then you'll invest your time on freeing up time and then you'll have at some point you will have a lot of time you can use for whatever you want and that's pretty good.